you are listening to the voice of the gospel a proclamation of the holy gospel by wisdom ministries december 14th monday let's begin this day with the blessings of god a reading from the holy gospel according to st matthew chapter 21 verses 23 to 27 when he entered the temple the chief priests and the elders of the people came to him as he was teaching and said by what authority are you doing these things and who gave you authority this authority jesus said to them i will also ask you one question if you tell me the answer then i will also tell you by what authority i do these things did the baptism of john come from heaven or was it of human origin and they argued with one another if we say from heaven he will say to us why then did you not believe him but if we say of human origin we are afraid of the crowd for all regard john as a prophet so they answered jesus we do not know and he said to them neither will i tell you by what authority i am doing these things this is the gospel of the lord praise you lord jesus christ my dear friends as with the first reading the, the gospel also deals with the issue of authority it is clear that the way of jesus used to teach uh, was a source of uh, disquiet among many of the jewish religious leaders they approach him one day in the temple and ask him by what authority are you doing these things and who gave you this authority jesus shall them directly answers provocative questions put to him and in this case as he does elsewhere he answers with a question of his own if they will answer his question he will answer theirs his question is what was the baptism of john the baptist of divine or human origin immediately his questioners were in a dilemma if they answer divine they will be further asked why they did not receive john's baptism we know that uh, john was uh, when john john the baptist was baptizing they came to observe but they themselves clarified they felt no need to be baptized themselves to do so would have been to put themselves on the same level as the sinful and unclean if they were to answer human then they would run the risk of offending the people who had no doubts about the matter they all held that john was a prophet the answer we do not know so jesus refuses to reply to their question uh, ultimately the leaders were being accused of a stubborn blindness unable and unwilling to see the hand of god either in the mission of jesus or of john they could not see that uh, the authority with which jesus spoke clearly resided in himself he was not just the bearers of a message he was himself the source of the message perhaps your word about authority may be relevant here yes the word comes from the latin word authoritas which is itself as abstract noun from the verb aggregare aggregare means to increase make bigger we find the same word in the word author a person with authority is not just someone who wields coercive power over them the exercise of genuine authority is not to control to keep in line but on the contrary to be an agent in releasing the potential that is in people to be an empowering agent jesus did not wield the coercive authority he invited people to follow him he came to serve not to be served he came to give life life in itself fullness he came to lead people into the full development of all they could be and were meant to be
He did this dramatically when he got down on his knees and washed the feet of his disciples. This was an act of authority, the authority of outreaching love. It is up to each one to decide whether to follow the way of love or to go one's own way. Amen. May God bless us.